Hey, how's everybody doing? Yeah, I'm in the main cave right now. Hold on a second. Yeah, I'm in the in the main cave, just hanging out. <coughs> Trying to multi well, semi multitask. Ain't getting nothing done. Miles around here somewhere. There she is. What are you doing? There's something up. <laughs> oh, it's just multi cast. <gasps> it's hot. I know. It's hot. What are you going outside? What's it like outside? What's it like outside? It's hot. 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 I same. It's hot. There, I just had my snack. Had the banana wrap. Fry, uh, no, fried banana wrap. It's hot today, man. It's hot. You call that turun. Turun. Turun? Yeah. I call it fly banana wrap. <laughs> I will go outside. You go outside? Yes. You see, it's been, it's been pretty sunny all day, but the clouds are starting to come in. Hopefully it rains. I know it's just to cool, cool things down, man. It's pretty hot. Let me go get you the temperature. It's... 91 degrees, 65 percent humidity. Woo -wee. Ooh. That's hot. <laughs> How many? 65. 66 now. Oh. Yeah, it's been an uneventful day all day, man. The electric bill came in. How much was the electric? 5,977.28 Yeah, it's, it's, we're kind of, we're not, I'm not going to sit there and try to bullshit people and say, oh, we're being conservative. We're not, we could be more conservative, but I'm telling you, man. But we don't, like I said before, during the day, periodically I'll turn it on for, for I, I have it on a timer for 30 minutes, okay? 30 minutes, what, every couple hours? Mm -hmm. And that's just to keep the room, you know, the humidity down, and it's somewhat comfortable. And yeah, the children, Mucky and Mimi, the two children, they're in there. And what's wrong with this? They're in there in a nice, comfortable room, and we're out here sweating our asses off. What's wrong <laughs> with this picture? I feel sorry. For, you know, a couple of nights ago, both the dogs sleep in the same room, sleeps in the room with us, which is which is fine with me. I don't care. Monkey, monkey usually sleeps on the floor. Once in a while he'll jump on the bed, but only stays there, what, 10, 15 Dude. minutes? And then he gets down. I don't know why, but he does it. He gets down. Mimi will stay up there all night. And she's like when you have a kid in the bed. She takes up a whole <laughs> lot of space. <laughs> and uh, and it really what gets me is a lot of times, man, she'll have, your, have her butt up facing towards us, and she's got <laughs> gas. Ooh. I usually take a pillow and I cover her butt up. <laughs> it stinks. How did I get into that conversation? Well, anyway. Yeah, so that's what we do, you know? And we just... But when we go in there at night, okay? I usually turn it on about 8 o'clock at night, and I set the timer for 6 hours. In other words, it goes from 8 o'clock to 2 o'clock in the morning. It's usually, I usually shut it off before then. I usually let it run for 2, about 2 hours. Usually 10 o'clock, I, I turn it off, I turn it on the fan. And it's fine for the rest of the night. And just in case I fall asleep, you know, the air, air conditioner ain't going to be running the whole time. It'll shut itself off. Because I'm telling you, man, I cannot, I don't know about y'all, but I cannot sleep in the heat. I can, well, like I said, the heat's not that bad as the humidity. I cannot sleep in the humidity. You know? And I know when it's hot in there when my owl kicks off the blanket. <laughs> when my owl kicks off the blanket, it's hot. Because she's like Nanook of the North, you know what I mean? It, it, when she goes in there, she puts the blankets on and everything like that. And I'll be sitting there with a pair of shorts and a t-shirt. 
But as soon as she kicks off the blankets, I know it's hot in there. So yeah, so we'll pay that bill. Just wait over it? No. Uh, probably tomorrow morning. I use GCOS. GCOS is the easiest thing to use here. I think it is the most easiest thing to use. I just go to any place that you can load your GCAS account. I put money in there. Usually it's 10000 a month. And that takes care of the bills. Once upon a time ago, 10000 didn't even cover the electric bill. Yeah. Because we were, I, was, I was being stupid. I had the air con in the living room <laughs> running all the time. I had the air con in the bedroom running all the time. I had the air con in this room right here running. But I still want to get an air con for the office. But that's only that's going to be like a 0.5. And then when you cook, half ton. When you cook, you, you use the air fryer. Yeah, a rice cooker. We have an air fryer. Everybody knows what an air fryer is, man. I'm starting to figure out because we have been. I mean, when we first got it, man, we used it like all the time, didn't we? All the time. We thought our reason to use it. But come to figure it out, you know, I think that's that's not good for your electric bill. Because you're you're running a fan, you know, inside of there and also the heating elements. How much power does it use? I have no idea. But it just seemed like when we when we were getting high electric bills. Twelve thousand, More than twelve thousand. Yeah, more just for electric more than twelve thousand a month. That's over two hundred dollars, man. You know, and I know, you know, you, everybody seems to forget. In the states, I say large majority of your place homes and apartments in the states is central air. Mm -hmm. You know, most mostly. Here, there's no such thing as central air on a home. No such thing. It's all window or or split con. And people say, well, can't, get you, can't you get central air? I have no idea. I have no idea. I mean, we if they did offer it, we could get it because we got a, a, a large attic. We have an attic and we can want it in there. But And another thing is these houses aren't made uh, energy efficient. I don't think they're energy efficient homes. How is how's that energy? Energy efficient. It kind of like keeps the... It keeps... The air... It keeps the hot air or the cold air outside from coming inside. That's the easiest way to describe it. And you have no air conditioning or heat loss leaving the house. But these houses aren't built that way, man. It's just the way it is. There's nothing you can do about it. This Sunday we go and Sunday on Sundays they, they uh, sell beef. Get some beef. Now wait, you keep, it's not for like steaks or anything like that. You can you can get beef cubes. You can make them. You can prepare beef cubes, but we mostly just grind it up and use it for hamburger. Different type, you know. Different types of ham. What's that? Here. Different types of, you know, with stuffed cabbage, stuffed peppers, and our spaghetti, hamburgers, meatballs, you know, things like that. When you make the spaghetti, you make the meatballs and all yeah. the meatballs. But also here, I know back <laughs> in the States, and I know this firsthand because I used to haul beef, is the average slaughter weight for cattle is 2,500 pounds and usually what a nine months to a year maybe a little bit longer a cow get the, uh, cattle get 2,500 pounds they kill it here when here they, they do it when they get old you yeah. know they wait till they get old so I can tell you how here how many in US how many months they said it I said usually they let, let them grow to like 2,500 pounds. That's usually within a year or so. 
hair, that, 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 that cow could be what? Four, five, six, seven years old? Mm -hmm. Huh? No? That one is only two years. The cow there. More than two years. <clears throat> and they use them for what? Working, right? Mm -hmm. No? What do they do with them? For sending. Oh, okay. And also you can get a what, water buffalo? Mm. You get they to have water buffalo. Now I, I don't know, is that any good? Mm. Have I ever had it? Same as as, mm. as cow. How's that? The meat is Yeah, but there's always each animal has their own distinct flavor. I mean there's just it might taste like it, but there might be something that, ha that you know, okay, no, this is buffalo, or no, this is cow, yeah. or no, no, you know what I mean? Yeah, but the meat is same. Uh, the, um, the smell, you can differentiate the smell of the buffalo and cow. I'll tell you, these flies will really start to irritate me. Hopefully they get rid of that paint soon. These flies, man. It's just, a, it's very annoying. Does it bother you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't have to. Ain't nothing else going on.